having an amphitheater here in amongst the farm country was threatening. We weren't necessarily a welcome voice. I can recall saying to him, who the hell would come here? I just didn't believe that there was enough draw way out here. This was simply rural eastern Washington. I thought, well, this looks like a pretty crappy place to have a show. But I filed it away as something, someday something's going to happen out here. In the beginning, it was tough because people did not know where this place was. I mean, everybody thought it was crazy, just didn't think anybody would go. Since it's 150 miles away from any population, he had to find a way to get people there. And the answer was music. I had given up on music, and that Stevie Ray Vaughan concert here at the Gorge put me back on the path of music. The next day I was like, I gotta play guitar again. I have to do it. The shows were always great, and they were always sold out. We enjoyed the audience and the atmosphere of it. If I look into the Gorge, I realize that really my significance is, if not exactly the same, more or less the same as a mosquito. Finding love at the Gorge, I didn't know it at the time. I had no idea what it was. She knew it would be the last time, but she just, just had to go. She was compelled to go one more time. As a venue, there's no place like it in the world. We should go to the gorge and have a good time. If you like to camp, party. <laughs> See you there. <laughs>